We test a lot of different fabrics and different membranes and uh, different systems. We try to do back-to-back -back tests where we'll actually make a garment that has material we know how it's going to perform on one side, the other side will have this new material. And we'll go out and test these backed out jackets and they look pretty strange. But it gives us a, a real world comparison on what happens. We can look at all the different test results that get handed to us, the lab results and that sort of thing. But it's a real world performance that we care about. And that's what makes a difference is trying the stuff out there. And that's when you notice the differences between the different materials and the different systems. One of the goals with our Gore-Tex jackets is to build a garment that is durably waterproof and the face fabric is a large part of the performance that you're going to get out of the Gore-Tex three-layer package. So we're looking for fabrics that have generally a plain weave construction because they're more durable from an abrasion perspective. Looking for fabric constructions that are fairly tight so that there's not very much yarn play movement happening within the structure. We want to have a fabric that doesn't or will maintain good water repellency and by that, we don't want to have any fuzzy yarns happening or breaking filaments, which can start to break the surface tension of water and break water beads that will form up. We've tested lots of other different windproof, waterproof, breathable membranes and fabrics. And in the end, Cortex gives us the best performance with the best durability.